been associated with war and know what that is. The people who are receiving the benefits of the soldier, his willingness to be sold out to be dyers, mm -hmm. we who, who pray for and send our sons and daughters off to war, mm -hmm. what's the most important thing we need to take from this book? Well, the question is, what should the civilian population take away from this, this story? Yeah. Well, a pride in a sense that they paid for it. Their tax dollars are paid for it. And they're part of it. They're backing it. And they, they make a complain about it, but they're backing it. One time I had to give a, a persuade speech. And so to persuade them, to feel good about giving to other countries as we do. The first year I gave the speech in the club, I was shot down because I didn't persuade anybody. I had a lot of people standing up talking about, I can't see us giving money that our grandchildren hadn't even earned yet to other countries. In other words, you know, shut up your bowels and leave them alone. Yeah. Or, you know, and it is logical. It's logical. That's why it's a persuade speech. It's so hard to give. So I, I went through the whole, uh, the whole year, went back the second year, and I, I could have changed my subject, but I didn't. I, I stayed with it. And so I had taken a scale, just a normal scale, tip scale, and set it up on the, on the lectern. Had to keep the angle off the lectern. I did you know, a lot of mechanisms. But I had 10 pennies in each pocket. And I said, well, I've got, I've got 10 reasons why we should feel good about giving. And in this pocket, I've got 10 that I shouldn't, that you shouldn't feel good. The ones, all of the arguments that I heard last year, and there were 10 or 12 of them. And so as I laid them out, all the money we give, you know, on the bad side, it never gets to where it really needs to go. <clears throat> Over here on the good side is we should never shut up our bowels to, to you know, others you know, other nations, or all of the reasons that Christ would give for helping the poor, the needy, the oppressed. And then when I got to the end of all of the arguments, I knew it would level out, because 10 pennies here and 10 pennies there ain't far from leveling out. It might have tipped a little bit. And I said, well, I've got this pearl of great price in this pocket over here on the good side. I said, which side do you think this pearl of great price should go? <laughs> oh, over here. So when I put it over here, it tipped the scales, pennies went everywhere, and I had the audience of the club helping me pick it up. Yeah. And I passed because that's the right thing to do.